win this football game, Jonathan. So that's a touchdown for the Gators. This is part of that tempo. A little play fake defense. Your eyes are in the wrong spot. And Woods has the opportunity to right, run right by Elam. Yeah, normally the guy that's got the mattress sweater vest on is it's a scene shot to Keon Zipperer. Huge for this Arkansas defense to get off the field without that flag getting thrown. Felipe Franks under pressure and down he goes. Sacked inside the 10 yard line. Ventrell Miller pays the price with a flag down. Felipe at the line of scrimmage has got to be seeing something in the defense that he wants to try and take advantage of, whether it's a scheme or a pass check. It's a three man rush, and still he's flushed out of the pocket. Felipe Frank's going to try and run for it and reaches the ball out to midfield, and he's a half yard short. Well, it's a passing situation here on third down. Trask bullets one over the middle. It's a blown coverage and a walk in touchdown for Trayvon Grimes. The second time he has found pay dirt here in the first half. Grimes at the bottom, and this is Hudson Clark. They're playing an in and out coverage, those two corners at the bottom. You get the in, you get the out. The miscommunication by those secondary players between him. One of the all time great players in the history of college football. Trask got the flea flicker. Had to scoop it up, still heaves it downfield to Henderson for the first down. Climbing the ladder, Justin Shorter, that's a Gators touchdown. Five frame shows off, look at that, that's fully, he's got to be eight, eight and a half feet in air right there, full speed. I, I think Wisconsin resume. should handle them tonight as well. Now having to start inside the 20-yard line, but breaking free. Have home run speed. And fits it in again to Trayvon Grimes. Now he's owning the line of scrimmage again, right? What run play do we want again? To what play action ball do we want? Off play action again. Looking downfield again. Taking a shot to the end zone. Again. Jacob Copeland. Touchdown. First half again. in the backfield right now you're just trying to see okay how does Florida respond can we get some kind of matchup as a quarterback run Felipe Franks four-man rush gets home and down he goes Zachary Carter gets through and gets the sack again with the timeouts here comes a blitz Trask floats one into the end zone just in the back corner it's hauled in by Zipperer for another Florida touchdown Zipper, track the ball, get your eyes up. Physically good enough. And I would just encourage people, make sure you're looking at it the right way with the, when it comes to the NFL spot. Felipe Franks over the middle to Traylon Burks, and that will take us to halftime. And Kyle Trask, the story, 285 yards. By head coach Sam Pittman. Team Boyd back into the left of Felipe Franks for second down and two. He'll take the handoff. Finds a crease, finds the end zone. Touchdown. Exactly the drive that Arkansas needed to open up the second half. Okay, that safety, that Stromberg, the center, kicks out. Kern leads up, and then he's teased that safety. Steiner dropped down, puts his foot in the ground, and goes north and south. And making everybody really nervous down in Gainesville. And so now this is such a big play to try and force third down to be a passing situation. Three-man rush gets home. Eric Gregory sacks Trask. That's an 11 yard loss. Trust him to that position. Henry Jones, second effort, gets a push. He's in. That's a Gators touchdown. Makes a pretty good pop here by Brown. Just the ability to keep those feet moving. Cross that goal line. Are the Gators bringing pressure? Delayed blitz. Felipe Franks goes down. Amari Bernie got home. So it has to matter or mean a little bit more of that being the case. Play action. Scene shot. First down and more. 
Grimes, all the way down to the 25 yard line. He's got some quarterback numbers in his arsenal, but he is a receiver for the Gators. And Naquan Wright with a stiff arm, slipping through tackler's arms. He is out of bounds at the 11 yard line. Zipperer has Kyle Trask touchdown pass number six. Just see the impact that it has on that linebacker right there. Watch him just hesitate for a second. The pump fake gets him to stop his feet. How about the ball? Just get it up over his head right there with enough air. Hearing that his grandfather had that impact on him. Fumble. Scooped up. Zachary Carter with a convoy. It's a scoop and score for the Gator defense. You go those two games and go for 900 yards and 10 touchdowns or something, it's going to be hard not to give you the trophy. Felipe Franks down the sideline. Mike Woods with a cutback. He already has a deep ball touchdown in this game, and he's going to try and find the pylon, and he will for an Arkansas score. Touchdown, Mike Woods. He scored on before, just that little fake. The safety drops down. Now it's one on one. He gets that left arm, a little bit of push off by Woods. And then the awareness to cut back across that field and run away from everybody. You can't think your way through progressions and know what defense you're getting and where the ball needs to go to. You're never going to be good. Emory Jones finds the end zone. A touchdown on the slant to Xavier Henderson. Jim catch this snap. Okay, hold that safety. Ball needs to go there. And it's got to go high down in the red zone above Catalan to Henderson. Lorenzo Lingard takes over it. Tailback. And Anthony Richardson. That wobbly pass is intercepted. It ends up in the arms of Jalen Catalan with a flag down. Stop this Florida offense, or at least a defense that's going to hold him under 40 or something like that. There goes Jefferson to the end zone for a touchdown. So the redshirt freshman backup quarterback, KJ Jefferson, scores for the first time in his career. There's that quarterback counter power or zone or power read where he's reading that defender and a great finish at the goal line. That's awesome by Felipe Franks. And Felipe Franks, as you said, played very respectably in his return.